This video is about the Katiga or Katiga CS121 on logs. So let's start with something like the log of base 525. Um, there's a rule that says you can go log of 25 divided by the log of 5. Okay. Um, because now, instead of base 5, which your calculator is based on base 10, we can use the calculator to do the calculation now with log base 10. <clears throat> so we click on log 25. And in this case, we can probably say divide, then the log again. And we do 5. And we press equals. That gives you 2. Okay. Then log of x, 25, equals 2. There's a rule that says that the log of base a, b, equals c uh, can be converted to a, c, equal b. Very important rule to remember. So we can do that here. Uh, x squared equals 25. Base x times uh, base x to the power of two equals twenty five. Then we take the square root on both sides. X equals square root of twenty five. Square root twenty five equals press equals, and then we get five. Okay. Uh, then the log, right? The log of base ten x equals two. Yes, that's a ten. So, based on this rule, 10 squared equals x, x equals, um, we can go 10, press y to the x, which gives you a caret, 2 equals, and we probably already knew that, 100. Okay, so let's do some anti-logs, 10 to the 2.5, uh, we can say 10, y to the x, 2.5 equals, and that gives you 3162277 and so forth. Another way we can do it, if you look at the log key, uh, in red, there's 10 to the x. So that looks like it's in red, though. Let's see. I don't know if alpha, alpha log, no. Uh, let's press AC. I guess, it, I guess it would still be shift. Shift 10, aha, uh -huh, 10, 2.5. That does, the notation doesn't look that great on this calculator, but okay. Press equals and gives you the same answer. All right. Uh, about 10 to the negative 1.5. Same thing. Shift and then the log button that gives you 10. Uh, plus or minus key, which is right here. Negative 1.5 equals. And that gives you... 0 0.03162 and so forth. That looks good. How about 10 to the half? All right. And we can still do this. 10, y to the x. And we have an ABC button. We're going to do 1, ABC, 2, equals. And it gives you 5, which is not the right answer. Hmm. So let's do this. Um, 10, uh, y to the x, let's put parentheses, 1, a, b, c, 2, close parentheses, equals, there we go, that's the answer I'm looking for, 3.1622, so you need to put parentheses, how about if we do this, shift, uh, log, and we said 1, a, b, c, 2, does that work? Yeah, didn't have to put parentheses there. Good to know. Uh, now you know. Uh, how about the log of eight? If if it's not written out, it's it's a base ten. So log eight equals very easy. Zero point nine zero three zero eight. <clears throat> so how about the log of eight squared? Hmm. So we go uh, log 8 and then squared and press equals and we get a 
answer of 1.806. It keeps going. There's a rule that says you can bring down the 2. 2 log of 8. So we can calculate it differently. 2 log 8 equals. All right. When you say 2 log 8, the 2 automatically multiplies with the log. And it gives you the same answer. All right. How about the natural log of 8? Natural log is right here. 8 equals, that's easy, 2.0794. Um, natural log, by the way, if it's going a little too fast, by all means, uh, pause it and then rewind and watch it. It takes a little time to, to do it. All right. Uh, also, if you like this content, please subscribe, please tell, please tell your friends and your teacher. And if you would like to support this channel, uh, by all means, please uh, press the thanks button and, and thank you for your support. Okay, natural log. Hmm. Natural log can be written as the log of base E, 8, which is the same answer. This E is right here. We're right above natural log e to the x. So if you press shift log, which is e to the 1, it gives you 2.71828. Okay? That's a lot of numbers. Now, if you remember back to this, right? If you say the log of 8 divided by the log of e, it should give you this answer. Let's see. I don't know. Uh, log 8 divided by log. This is going to be tricky because we're going to need shift E to the 1. Will that work? Uh, 2.0. Yep, there it is right here. 2.07. Okay. Well, that was interesting. Now, all this that I talked about is for your understanding of where the log key comes from and what it does, okay? A lot of these things, a lot of these steps you don't have to do, but it's always interesting to know where it comes from. All right, so we're gonna take e to the negative 1.8, so shift e to the x, right? Negative, which is down here, 1.8 equals, and we get, 0 0.16529, okay, which is, that's the answer. Then, natural log of x equals 3. Natural log is what? Log base e, x equals 3. e to the third equals x. What is e to the third? Well, shift, natural log, Press 3, so it gets e to the third equals, and we get x equals 20.0855. Keeps going. That's the answer. What does that mean? Well, if you go back to the natural log of 20.0855, keep all those numbers, that should give you 3. So let's see. If we press natural log, and then the last answer, shift, last answer, press equals, gives you 3. Interesting, isn't it? A lot of steps. And it's super hard to do at the beginning. Okay? It takes a lot of mental e exercise, mental power. But I'll tell you this. The more you practice, the better you'll get. And the more successful you will feel. So, uh, don't give up. Keep doing it. I hope to see you soon. Have a great semester. And again, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>